Okay guys, so here's the deal about breakouts. I've been breaking out for the last two months and it's just getting worse and worse. So I went to Sephora and I got a few new products and I'm just hoping that they'll start working soon. Um, I feel like it's made a difference over the last two days. I think that you do need about seven days to see if a product is going to be good for you or not. So I'll let you guys know in seven days how my skin has turned around. So far, it's um, I feel like I've had less pimples popping up. Um, my skin tone seems to be evening out a little bit more. Before I was blotchy red over here and here and here, and I had a lot of scars all over my chin. So the scars on the chin have started to heal, and I haven't been breaking out since I got the products. I got this stuff. It's two products by Bliss. One of them is an oil control moisturizer, and the other one is a correcting serum. Basically, I wash my face, and then I put the serum on, like the spots that I've been breaking out and the spots that have um, scarring. And this product is supposed to even out your skin pigmentation from scarring, so I put that on first, and once that dries, I put the lotion on after. And then I go and I do my run, I go and I work out, I go on the bicycle, and I sweat and stuff, and haven't been breaking out since. Before, I think the problem was that I was putting on this body lotion that was really thick on my face, and then I would go and run, and when I'd sweat, my pores would open up, and I feel like that product was going into my pores and causing it to clog and causing me to break out. So having a great product on your face if you're going to be sweating is ideal if you're going to have anything on it at all. Um, I also got this product called Cl Crazy for Clear. It's uh, part of the clean scene, and it's a spot treatment for acne. So I used this earlier today on a pimple that I had got on my forehead and it's already lowered its height. Um, it was like a volcano before and now it's just like a tiny little bump. Another face product is the Clear Prep FX Primer. I thought it was important to get a primer because I never have used a primer before. When I did my makeup I just kind of like slapped on foundation as a prime base and then I'd slap on more foundation and slap on another layer of powder. So I figure it might be a smart idea to use a primer. This is an anti-acne treatment gel. So this product contains salicylic acid, which is supposed to be really good for preventing acne. So if you're going to have this product on your face before you put your makeup on, it's great because it'll prevent acne um, for your bottom layer. And anything else that goes on top of that really won't affect your skin as much if this is protecting you. So the psychology behind that kind of makes sense to me. I don't know if I'm 100% right on it. Once again, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's a good idea. And once again, I'm just learning. So if you have any tips for me and you know anything that might help me from breaking out, please let me know because I'm always looking for advice on stuff like that. So thanks for watching and I hope you have a good week.